Well, Parker's Kitchen presents Fill the Park in partnership with the City of Savannah and WJCL 22. It is the free concert that fills Forsyth Park with thousands of people every year. All week long, we are getting you ready for that big day, telling you all about the amazing performers and how it's going to impact our community. Yeah, WJCL 22 News' AJ Sisson spoke with Olivia Parker, the daughter of Greg Parker, about the Parker's Community Fund and how they aim to give back to Savannah. We're really working on a good partnership to get some good exposure to the Savannah Philharmonic to see everything that they do to give back to our city to create, you know, a strong link between Savannah and the arts. On Saturday, nearly 20,000 people will fill Forsyth Park for the Savannah Philharmonic's annual concert. Parker's Kitchen presents Fill the Park in partnership with the city of Savannah and WJCL 22. Everything that they do in the community and what they stand for is really some of what we stand for at the Savannah Philharmonic where, where we bring music to everyone. You know, they're really out there in the community and supporting everyone as to bring us all together. Once a sponsor in years past, now Parker's aims to not only present a concert filled with special guests like Flauge Johnson and winners from the American Traditions Vocal Competition, but to build on giving back to the community. My dad always says is it's really a part of our DNA, giving back. We want to be a force of positive change in every area that we're in. The theme for this year's concert is Savannah the Beautiful. Well, it's kind of a note to America the Beautiful, but you know, Savannah is one of the most beautiful cities, if not the most beautiful city in the United States. An idea both the Philharmonic and Parkers decided on, and for the Parkers Community Fund, that for the last seven years has donated more than $30 million to communities across Georgia and South Carolina. They give so much away and they believe so much in everything and the fact that they believe in what the Philharmonic is doing to come alongside this for an event really that brings 25,000 people from diverse neighborhoods and diverse communities together to just enjoy music alongside one another. Every community that we go into we're going to continuously give and find those charity partners that we're are really impactful so that we can really touch the lives of all of the community members in those areas. And this was filled the park last year and this year they expect it to be even bigger and that theme Savannah the beautiful also applies to a picnic table competition which you can find more information about on our website wjcl.com in studio AJ Sisson WJCL 22 news.